with this first story, though. Uh, a man accused of brandishing two large knives outside Buckingham Palace has been charged after being tasered by police. Police used a stun gun when he was seen ranting when challenged outside palace gates on Sunday morning. And this happened... This is the footage here, which is... Uh... It was a changing of the guard ceremony, so hundreds of tourists and Londoners all out to see... A number of papers right. say have got the man's photograph. Obviously, Buckingham Palace has refused to comment because it's a police matter, they say. It's an ongoing investigation. But obviously, this chap needed help and wanted help, and hopefully he'll get the help he needs because mm. it must have been an appalling sight to have been there and terrifying. Because some people were saying on the news last night that they thought it was the start of some kind of coordinated attack. And, of mm. course, there's absolutely no evidence of that, and only yeah. the one man has been taken into custody. But very terrifying. You've, uh, you've got to say, when you watch that footage, um, how brilliantly the police handled it in front of all those tourists. And also, if you look at that footage, the policeman who does taser him has got a gun. And I think in some countries... He may not have been quite so lucky, and he might have ended up being shot. It's true, isn't it? And also, after he was tased, if you notice, 15 police officers surrounded him as well, so that for all those people that were there, they were sort of having to look at the situation that was going on, but really quite frightening, I imagine, if you, you think, were a tourist. Do you think taser was necessary? Uh, well, the man 15... brandishing two knives in front of tourists, <coughs> I should think so, yes. Do you not think it is? Well, there were 15 policemen there, and there are other methods of stopping somebody. What other methods? What do you well, expect, him to, expect him to do? Pepper spray. I suppose you have to get quite. Oh, you want to keep a bit of a distance, so we've done. You need a big old canister of pepper. pepper sprays, you've got to go right up to someone to spray them. And I think the whole point of the taser is the fact that you can do it at distance, and and the policeman stays safe, and the public stays safe. But I still think it's quite it's quite a violent method of stopping someone. And well, who's brandishing two knives? Yeah, but still, I, I think you have to be very careful. Oh, how, well, I'm, I, how, how interesting. <laughs> we, we vehemently disagree on, okay. the, on the news review. Namby-pamby approach to policing. <laughs> right, OK, well, let's move on then. Um, uh